very much, Jack, and all of you for coming. I feel welcome. I must. Say, this is my first time in the USA, and uh, I must confess I did not feel welcome when I had to transfer in the Philadelphia airport, and I spent two hours from one queue to the next, and I was grilled, and I had to give ten fingerprints and, and give a photograph. But when I came to San Fran, I did begin to feel welcome. So thank you very much. Um, the passport, some copies of which you can find behind me, was written three years ago for many, many different reasons, both personal and collective. Um, one of the personal reasons, I was traveling in South America with the backpack a few years ago, and on the border between Peru and Bolivia, a small village called Casani on Lake Titicaca, uh, I was waiting in the queue with my Maltese passport. This is my, my real Maltese passport. Now Malta, of course, it's a small country, half a million people, um, the size of San Francisco Peninsula. So it's normal that in other continents it may be unheard of, but still, in the queue, I gave my Maltese passport to the soldier, and he stared at it like this. Malta! 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 I started to get nervous. And there was another soldier by a desk. He got all excited. And he uh, banged his hand on the desk and he said, Malta! And the reason why he was so excited was because on the desk there was a piece of paper sellotaped to the desk with a list of countries and next to each country the price of the visa and so he said to me uh, usted tiene que pagar I don't know 498 bolivianos I just heard all these syllables I, that made me more nervous I thought it would cost me a lot of money and then he said if you want you can pay in US dollars it's 55 dollars but we don't give any change you must pay in the exact money and I had a 100 dollar bill so I spent the next 20 minutes negotiating with other people in the queue, most of them from the US, explaining each time from a small country in the Mediterranean. And I gave, I don't think I've ever given so many geography lessons in such a short time. But anyway, the people helped me to get the change and I managed to get in with a visa for 30 days. And my traveling companion from the Czech Republic got in free of charge with a visa for 90 days. People from the US, uh, who helped me to get the change, they have to pay, or at least this was the situation three years ago, $180 to enter Bolivia. And later I found out why. That's because Bolivians who apply for a visa to come to the US have to pay, guess how much? The same, $180. It's a reciprocal, childish game between nation states. This is just the tip of the iceberg, okay? With my EU passport, I can go pretty much anywhere I want. Um, people from the southern half of the world find it more difficult, of course, to travel. So, freedom of movement depends on the GDP of your nation state. The world will not be truly round until there is freedom of movement for everybody. Yeah. Yeah. So, this washing line that you see behind me, okay, it's a tightrope. This is the tightrope that migrants have to walk across if they're searching for a better life or escaping persecution, okay? Um, what I'm going to do, I'm going to uh, temporarily sacrifice my identity. It's not really my identity, it's just a document. And my ESTA, this is the visa I had to apply for online to come to the US. And the only option to pay for this visa was by credit card. Which means if you don't have a credit card, you can't apply for a visa. Without a credit card, you're no one.
they put that piece of paper on. So, um, we're going to be reading this passport poem in the original language, Maltese, which, as you'll hear, is a mix of Arabic and Italian. It's very much a migrant language, as all languages are, because words immigrate and emigrate, and they take root in other, in other languages. The beauty of language is that the borders are very porous. Um, if only national borders were just as porous, too. And we're going to dedicate this reading in particular to an Iraqi poet called Sabah Jassim, who was invited to the festival three years ago, but was awarded the visa on the last day of the festival. Yeah. So uh, he didn't make it on time. Um, one of the invited poets for this festival, Fernando Rendon from Colombia, didn't even bother applying for a visa because it would have taken uh, too long and it would have given him a lot of hassle. He's an activist in, in, in Colombia. And I'd like to dedicate it also to any of you in the audience who have ever had trouble crossing a border. I'm very honored to be joined by Matt Gonzalez to be reading in tandem Maltese and English. One last thing before we read. This anti-passport is for sale at the uh, Reader's Bookstore and on Amazon. And a couple of days ago, I went to visit the East Bay Sanctuary, which is an NGO based in Berkeley that uh, offers legal assistance to asylum seekers. And they specialize in four different groups of asylum seekers. There are categories there too. Um, one of them is indigenous people from Guatemala, LGBTs, including from Africa and the Middle East, uh, Tibetan monks, um, and well, there are many other groups too, and victims of domestic violence or state violence. So part of the profits from the sale of this anti-passport in the US will be donated to the East Bay Sanctuary Covenant. Support. Tiak, Habib Yo Habiba, Tal Albut Al Jilda, Lichatni Bedekitnein, Felhanu Meliesa, Ul Aitni, which school, Umiftuch, Tiak, Daulisteir Taramel Yit Harik, Torum Yo Orbu, Eholu Shushitum Firich, Steir Tibrayit Albu, Limwij Paltibi Itain Yin. Lienal Upsaha, Teptip Tablatmium, Tasmeweti Ganju, Minfuda Minichache Tondia with Temprati, Blariar E Adur Mahom Fniffs, Mehus in Das, Tashmayar in Issue, Yefirshum Shfir, Uyen Firshu Shushin, Pal Ilsna Yilta of Destin, Pal Ilsna Yinkla of Estin, Ilsna Yazol Ujakub Sami Uweza, Das to Fear Ham Lachma in Hamra Migduma for Ned. Of a kid, no hard. Ilsnail is no kelma amri. Sit telefu wahdania. Fbel satuila for kurs gol of a kurshad. Stay. Did the jakilotia? Stay. Takulio. But a kulhat. Yours, old or new friend of the heart and of the skin, who grasped me with both hands, strong and caressing, and welcomed me with a warm and open face. Yours, these stories of sands adrift, of approaching dunes, their hair loose in the wind, stories of raging seas, the waves in descent, like eyelids crashing shut in an endless blinking of chameleon skies, pierced through by round or sharpened peaks, and circled by the measured equal eddies of thin air, of streaming rivers sprung from the horizons, spreading forth in a slather like tongues in faded encounters, like tongues in festive communion, tongues a swirl in a vessel, the depth and breadth of a full, 
fleshed apple, flushing red, bitten at the top and on three sides, tongues pronouncing a moon-filled word, six thousand yet one, in a long embrace on every outcrop, every shore, stories that were already yours, stories of every day, of every all. Habib al Habiba, Tadem Mutalahan, Wichik Manafli at Raitu, is the Narfic Seo, Niftakarni Nimshimiak Flin Forna Tabisweet in Kustiri, Ufil Boot Tamal Kosha, Tiak Tanil Kteyeb, Mamul Mineru Omin Frey Makul Folly with Nibtamil Jdid, Mamul Mishayu mit Ear, Milechet Shir, Mitrab Tamal Itrir. Im Shabba bil fuar bil shita, bil sirda u bil nida, bil ara kiesach, u bil tmoch tan niket yaw ferch, t'il bil chomb u bil ram, u khafif ta'asil rish, b'tebaat ta khamriya min lasa, dirmi, u yuni, karnataka, lim naidra, u dar es salam, bil ziffa mil khat berrach il pulmun, u bil moch bhal im rewcha, Buena nishif tarrant, tan man nich u tal koka, brat ta hail il pachamama u lilik daqsin sew, tchai yaw chaya daqs lichken khleyna, u daqs likbar u kol. Bmappa fonda ta dinja, bla liwja yaw tinja, tonda, preciza, bil pacifiku fin nofs, u minajr ta uwic, jek tchallini, im pinjia fuq darik, Yeah, I'm sphere. Fukul Sidhir. Yours, old or new friend of the blood and of the flesh, your face I can't remember having known, yet I recognize you well. I remember journeying with you in the lining against your ribs and in the pocket against your thigh. Yours, this little book made of roots and of branches, re-sprouting on every page, made of barley and flour, of old man's beard, of the dust along the open road, soaked through with steam and rain, with damp and dew, with cold sweat and with tears of sadness or joy, heavy with lead and with copper, and light as a feather, stained with the earth of Lhasa, Dermi, Uyuni, Karnataka, Minidra, and Dar es Salaam, with the salty breeze that opens out the lungs and fans out the mind, with dried leaves of laurel, of mint and coca, in homage to Pachamama and equally to you, imbued with life as the smallest of creatures and as the very largest, with a deep map of the world, with no fold or crease, round, precise, Pacific-centered and undistorted. If you let me, I'll paint it on your back or draw a hemisphere on each breast. Habibi al Habiba, ta nifsu ta sinsla, ta ruh u ta mudullun, ta listes generazioni tiei, tuelit meta tuelit, il machti zerni fichbu bainik, u ishemsh fin zugla, ta listes paisaj tiei, tuelit fei tuelit, chaseitek fil blad u fil bliid. Tiak il hashish ta palmanok, il rao wa tlembe bit chak ta isla negra, u i zifna ta del u i di o ma dirayn il banyan, ta shanti niketan. Tiak il kermet chimkowe, al diafa, liberté, heywa, yipimpak, swagata, imbizo imbizo. Tiak il piacir, palpabli u pullulanti, ta albit palpat, fideik harkir. Yours, old or new friend of the breath and of the spine, of the soul and of the marrow, of my own generation, whenever you were born, I have glimpsed the daybreak in your eyes and the setting sun of my very own landscape. Wherever you were born, I have sensed you in the rock and in the cities. Yours, the grass of Pamanuk, the foam rolling out of the pebbles of Isla Negra, and the dance of light and the shade in the arms of the Banyan of Shantineketan. Yours, the words Chimkau, Liberté, Heywa, Lipimpak, Embizo, Embizo. Yours, the palpable 
pulliolating pleasure of a heart pulsating in your ardent hands. Tiak dan el pasaport al publico. Yours, this passport for all peoples. Bandir au salla, ubar matawisa migratoria durmal globu. With a rainbow flag and the emblem of a migratory group goose encircling the globe. Bilingui kolali treat, ufichani umush. In all the languages you want, official or dialect. Bil oshra kakhla ochian, yo hamra dem nishef, yo seuda faham lestal khru. Brazilian. In ocean blue or dry blood red or coal black ready for burning, the choice is yours. Who do fetish tear? Il passaj sicuru in berrach, il bib, ma'luch mit chachis. Take it where you will, your passage is safe and unobstructed, the door unscrewed from the jams. You can enter and leave without fear, there is no one to stop you. No one to jump you in the queue or send you to the back, there's no need to wait. No one to say your papers, please, quickening your heartbeat with the pallor of his finger. Blachat, my perich, you will wear it, I neich, scontil prodot domestico gross per capita, tan nation nitralni waraik. No one to squint or glare at you according to the gross domestic product per capita of the nation you left behind. Blachat, my odok barani, alien, criminal, immigrant, illegali, yo ex. No one to brand you stranger, alien, criminal, illegal, immigrant, or extra communitaire. Nobody is extra. Blahat my Irish speak. Gringo, Paki, Cholo, Creamy, Sudaka, Goliwog, Chink. No one to call you Spick, Gringo, Paki, Cholo, Creamy, Sudaka, Goliwog, Chink. Blahat my Puntale Kalashnikov, you in Nebeta Kelb, Palmuntani Fushin. No one to train a Kalashnikov on you, nor the crowded, craggy canines of a half-starved dog. Blachet chat, my jelik toot kok kamal chait, chait de fislek i du midil kamin tacht, ou i fittesh bil kalma. No one to squat you down against the wall, to slip a well-lubed hand in from underneath and search with calm. Blachat my sakrek jog sikh ta gabuba, ou i alf te kil barra wara klitigiri khol mikrach minai spiega ta shein, i dem aduin chapas masol monk. No one to lock you up in the chill of a cell, only to throw you out again after a sweaty three-night ordeal. No reasons given, the blood still drying on your ass. Take it where you will, there is no need to show it. No need to give your name, the where, the when of your birth, your sex, your profession, your race or your roots. No need for a serial number, a vexed old picture, your vital measurements on a silicon chip, or any other dates or data, your whys and wherefores. Memsh bzon li titamish, bisken retinali, aynik zbiech, tistazom malik, walmin etchob. No, no need to be blinded by a retinal scan. Your beautiful eyes are yours to keep and to offer to the ones you love. No need to tick boxes A through Q in black ballpoint pen in black capitals and in English. No need to obtain a signature from your mayor, from a lawyer or notary, and least of all from your parish priest. No 
No need to leave within 90 days or 30 if you live in a small country the customs officials never seem to have heard of. Mems bżonn biljett ta' ritorn lu kanda bukkjata itra uffiċjali ta' sterina jew prova ta' mezzi monetari. No need for a return ticket, a hotel reservation, an official letter of invitation or proof of monetary means. Mems bżonn sedula di identidad bit tepa sewdina ta' sebek u bil oħob ta' ħajtek imħabsa għala li zbarri suwed. No need for a cedula de identidad with the dirt black stain of your finger and your life's intrigues and doings jailed behind the black bars. No need for a Tito de Sejur, Cartao de Cidadao, Lichna Carta, Gutiger Personal of Weiss. No need for a Teo da Zehut Pita at Hawiya Nufus Chustan, Goiko Kuin Toro Kushome Show, or Jai Chung Min Nandan. No need for a DNI, Electronico, DUI, DPI, UID, MICAD, CURP, or CNIC. No need for a Native American tribal ID card, an I-872 American Indian card, an enhanced tribal card, or applicable, or any other WHTI compliant papers. No need for an identity card emblazoned with the Eagle, the Southern Cross, or the Union Jack. No need for signed declarations to the effect that Mahoma is the sole true prophet and all others a bunch of imposters. Faith does not come into it. British Nationality Selection Scheme no need to enroll in the British Nationality Selection Scheme or to pass a Britishness exam. No need to swear undying loyalty to a scalding symbol or to accept the static notion of nation-state. No need for a na naturalization certificate. You are not a subject or object. No need to request an extra passport to take a trip to Tel Aviv from Beirut, Baghdad from Manila, Belgrade from Pristina, uh, Nicosia from Skopje, or the other way around. No need for a laser passer to enter Brazil from the Central African Republic from Bhutan to Taiwan. No need to be among the 50,000 names drawn yearly in a lottery for a green card. No need to fork out 55 or 71 or 180 dollars. No change given because you happen to have seen the light of day in a cowboy democracy or rogue state. No need to freeze your tail off for three interminable hours at the height of winter until your tongue ices over to be finally summoned in for the interview and asked if you are a terrorist. No need to spend 18 months of your life cursing through the sludge with fellow guns and soldiers at the state's behest. No need to spend 18 months of your life waiting for the breeze to sweep through the